chefing it up in the kitchen. Come through, come through, girl, you know we got nice to do, nice to do. Come through, come through, come through, come through, come through. Baby boy, you stay on my mind, Hi guys, <laughs> welcome back to the vlog. I can't take this off my head, it's too big. Too big or too small? No, my head is too big. I brought something. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> getting the free shell boys. <laughs> this girl is crazy. <laughs> These are the pains of content day. So we're having a content day. Pieces taking some content pictures. Everybody go run up her Instagram. I'll yes. leave it in the description box. Follow me. You guys love her already. But um, yeah, today's Sunday. Um, welcome back to a weekly vlog. Starting off the vlog with a Sunday content day. I'm giving this content day to Jesus. Mm -hmm. And amen, all of these pictures will come out fire. It has to. Amen. But um, yeah, peace is changing Whoa, into her first so outfit. Big? Why is my head so big? <laughs> okay, you got it. <sighs> and this is why for content creators, when you're doing content days, you come in your first outfit. No, I was going to wear this year and I thought, oh no, this dress is hard to put on. Let me wear it. Why does that make any sense? I'm done. I don't know why that makes any sense, but anyway. Guys, I'm learning, please. I'm a student in the game. But, um, yeah, that is what we gonna do. So, I'm gonna take you guys with me. And, yeah, let's get the show on the road. Let's do, get do, to work. Do, 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 do. Background music, cue. I'm do, done. Do, do, do. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, so into the second outfit. Peace is not naked anymore, so she can say hi. Oh, wow. Hi, guys. So look at her. Stunning. Yeah. Stunning. <laughs> so we're taking a second pick. We're gonna do some car park picks, see how it comes out. I'm gonna put you guys on a time wrap so you guys can see the fun. That's really fun. The girls at work. I'm wearing this gorgeous dress from PLT. Um you guys will probably already seen it, so my PLT home, which will be out before this. So buy it. Yeah, let's go. What's up? How are you guys doing? So, today is Tuesday, as I just said. Back home. So, last time I saw you guys was when I was with Peace, shooting some content. Yeah, so that was Sunday. So, I didn't vlog yesterday um, because I didn't do anything yesterday. And I actually wasn't at home. So, there's that. I'm going to kick off vlogging this week. You guys know 
um, I wasn't really feeling too well in January, towards the end of January. So for like two weeks, a week, I didn't really vlog. I didn't really do much, but a babe is back and feeling so much better. When your body is not, all is not okay with your body, like you really, really feel it. Health is definitely wealth, baby. So I'm so glad that I'm back and I'm feeling better and we're back vlogging. So um i have a few parcels to show you today i was supposed to film my plt video but that didn't happen so what i'm gonna do today is actually clean my whole entire house there's really not much to clean it's just you know actual maintenance i actually did find some cleaners shout out to you guys a lot of you guys sent me some suggestions a lovely lady on instagram actually sent me a suggestion for a cleaner so she was supposed to come today but basically i wasn't going to be at home during the time that she needed to come so i'm um, rearranged for next week but um hopefully she doesn't think i'm just a flake and doesn't message me back <laughs> for this week i'm gonna clean my house so I've dedicated the rest of today to cleaning. Hopefully it doesn't take that long. It always does, but yeah. Some deliveries that I wanna show you guys and some PR stuff. So the first thing I wanted to show you guys is a parcel that I got from Daily Sleeper, but they were on sale and I've wanted a sleeper set for so long. So I thought, you know what? Let me just get it because it was on sale. I'm not sure what the set is called, but let me check. So I got the weekend sheet set with leggings in white. I ordered this from their site. It took about, um, I've actually already tried it on. But I just wanted to show you guys. It took about, when did I order this? Just under two weeks to come, which is quite some time, but I think it was coming from America. Actually, no, it was delivered yesterday. So it took 10 days to come. So I ordered the weekend set, which is just so gorgeous. I cannot wait to wear this. So I got the white and it comes with the furry sleeve and it comes with the matching leggings with the fur on the, on the bottom of the pants. I got this in a size medium because they don't do different sizes for the top and the bottom. Fits so nicely on. I will say though, like if you're gonna buy this set, definitely size up. It has some stretch, but it's not stretchy. I fit very nicely into the top because I'm smaller on the top. But for the bottoms, if my ass gets any fatter than it already is, these will not fit. So I'm thinking I should have got a large and then just taken it in. When you buy on the actual sleeper site, I don't think you're able to do returns or exchanges with sale items. So yeah, that's a bit annoying. But oh my God, I cannot wait to wear this. I will maybe get another color later on this year when they go back on sale. But yeah, oh my God, absolutely love. Um, I paid like a hundred pound total for everything, including delivery. I have a video that I want to film that I cannot wait to wear this in. So I think it's really good for content. On spring, summer, I'm going to wear it like actually outside with some gorgeous heels. I'm going to brunch. A oh, look, honey. Then I got some PR from Too Faced. I actually have not opened this yet, so let's get the scissors. Lady Bold. Wow. Let's open this up. This is the Too Faced Lady Bold set to you guys collection. Empower Pigment Cream Lipstick. Let your lips do the talking without ever saying a word. This looks absolutely lovely. Oh, we've got this nice, like, nudie paint colour. This is called Hype Woman. Can you guys see? I feel like such an old YouTuber. Definitely cannot wait to try those. Oh, and did you guys notice I finally spray painted this black after ages of saying I would do it finally did it and it looks so good I got a lovely PR box from L'Oreal Paris and this is their Revitalist collection super surprising excited when I saw this 
how lovely so they sent me their l'oreal paris vitalift five percent pure glycolic acid peeling toner smooth and glowing skin in 30 seconds l'oreal paris vitalift 10 percent pure glycolic acid and then i got the l'oreal paris revitalift filler plus hyaluronic acid 2.5 percent this is interesting and then i got the base serum and this is the revitalift filler hyaluronic acid and this is, has 1.5 percent then i got this package from sai 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 I'm not sure how you pronounce it. I feel like I should know how to pronounce it. But um, thanks so much to first the, the agency and SIA for sending this out. So they sent me their fluffy brush. Oh, lovely packaging. This is what it looks like. And it's a powder. And this is in the color translucent. Yeah. They sent me another shade called Translucent Medium. And that's a darker colour. And then we got a another PR box from Sand and Sky. So they sent me their Sand and Sky Australian Pink Clay Deep Pore Cleanser. I'm always looking for new skincare stuff to try. How pretty is that? And the packaging is pink. That is going straight into my bathroom. No question marks. And then they sent me the Australian Pink Clay Pore Refining Face Mask. I love anything that says pore refining on it. Give it to me. And give it to me quickly. So it comes with a little face mask brush, which more face masks should do because who do you guys still put face masks on with your hands? I always use a brush. This is the little package it comes in straight into my bathroom. Oh, it smells good. Oh, and it's pink as well. We'll definitely be trying this. And then it comes with, oh, this lovely Sand and Sky hairband. Beauty hairband. I love using these, you guys know. I wear these all the time, so thank you to Sand and Sky. Okay, so the last PR box we have is from the beloved Kim Beauty. And this is their Valentine's Day love box. I think they had one last year. I absolutely loved it. First thing is their new eyeshadow set. And I absolutely love Kim Beauty eyeshadows. And this is the Eden Shadow Palette. And the colours in here are so stunning. Of course, it comes with a mirror. And then they sent this body oil, which I cannot wait to try. Because I use some of the body collection stuff, but not all of it. So I cannot wait to try this oil. And you guys know I love the Ken Beauty packaging. Ooh, my bet. Ooh, look at a bitch braid. My obsession with TikTok is very bad. Ken Beauty lip gloss and this is called cherry what's this called cherry something i can't see but this looks like this gorgeous like pinkish glittery color which i love stuff like this and then they sent me this mini melt it balm how cute is this and it's pink I don't even want to use this, but this is going straight into my bathroom. So a highlighter they sent me is Sun, Sunbeam, and another one they sent me is Carrots. They sent me this candle, and this is the Flora More, Flora More candle. This is a limited edition candle. So once this comes, and girls, you're not getting it again. So make sure you get your hands on it i don't like it's such 
the chem beauty stuff i absolutely love but their candles are so unique like i haven't smelled a candle like this before one more thing to show you guys and it's a pair of shoes these are the shoes from asos i'll link them down below look how gorgeous they are i definitely put these on my story so you guys will probably have seen these but i wanted to show you guys as well gorgeous amina mawadi dupes i don't know if you guys seen those amina mawadi satin heels but they're like 600 pounds and these were like 17 so i even got them for 15 because i love buying stuff when they have a sale like you can get a discount code on sale stuff i love doing that that's my drug so i actually got these for 15 and look how gorgeous they are absolutely stunning oh stunning with this outfit on they have them in a black color as well i got these in a size six and they fit perfectly oh my god absolutely love them so shout out to kk for putting the girls on i hope you guys are having a great day whatever day that you're watching this we've got a lot to do today i have to film my valentine's day haul which is a pretty little thing video I haven't done one in quite some time so i want today's video to be good so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna put on a face mask actually it's going to look somewhat decent this is the closest one to me i have some new face masks that i want to try about I don't want to risk it for a chocolate biscuit. Um, and an importance when I knew it's going to be good. So I'm just going to go in with my Trusty Chem Beauty Pink Clay Face Mask. And this is actually finishing, so I actually need a real. Feeling a bit, my throat is feeling a bit this morning. But I don't know why, because I wasn't really around people yesterday. Every time I get around people, um, my body has some sort of new ailment. It's like COVID has just like taught us how to be alone so much that like my body is not used to people. It's like Lisa, who and what is this, honey? What is this, honey? I have a few things to do this morning that I didn't finish doing yesterday. I need to empty the dishwasher because I left it on last night. So I thought it would just be wise to put on a face mask first thing this morning, start doing those chores when I've finished, jump into the shower, and let's get ready to start the day. Face mask is on. Looking like crazy woman i'm gonna make my bed last so i saw a tiktok that says you should actually leave your bed like um like opened and just how it was when you woke up for like at least half an hour an hour to like don't just make it straight away to like let out all the funk from your bed i don't know that's probably just possibly a big fat lie but um yeah let's let's get to it happy wednesday it's a glorious morning very sunny today so hopefully that will be good for filming Good evening. Is this a good angle? I feel like it's a bit 
dark. So I have finally finished um, filming my V-Day QLT haul. This is one of the things that was in the haul. It's just gone 7.30, so I'm quite happy. Um, I finished... I finished relatively on time. I did like kind of like, as I usually do, um, procrastinate for a little bit. So, I thought once I finished one haul, why not get into another pretty little thing haul? Um, I've had some really cute loungewear bits that um, I've been ordering for the longest time. And I thought this would be the perfect time to come and show you guys all the pieces that I actually bought. Should we go to the bedroom? Because I like keeping it fresh and keeping it interesting for you guys, I have moved into my bedroom for a lovely bedroom haul. But yeah, let's get into the stuff. Do not order all of this stuff at one time, so do not, do not fear. First thing is this really cute t-shirt and it just says, kind people are my people in this pink slogan thing. And I just thought that was really, really cute. Definitely wear this as a t-shirt dress if I got a bigger size. Just a really cute t-shirt. Okay guys, so this is the second item. It's this short sleeve jumpsuit and then it's a legging, comes all the way down into like a long, long length legging. I'm not sure about it because I really don't like this line at the top. It's giving a bit grandma me. I'm not sure. Like, does it fit nicely or it doesn't? Like, what do we think? Is it a good fit, not a good fit? I'm not so sure. Mm. Oh no, this, this this can be. Gearing towards yes, keep it, but I just don't like this bit. I'm not really sure about what's going on there. And I feel like it doesn't frame my body as nicely as it can. But like I'm really, I'm really loving the idea and concept of this. So let me know what you guys think. Is it a yes or no? Maybe so. Does it look good on me? Does it not? Okay, guys. So then I picked up the exact same thing, but in the black. The black is looking just a tiny little bit better on the body. But if it just didn't have these lines, like. Is there a way for me to like get rid of those lines? Otherwise this would be perfect. But I'm also thinking like, do I get it in a smaller size? But I think this is like, I don't know, an all right fit. Okay guys, so then the next thing I actually picked up was this gorgeous leather coat. And you guys will let me know whether you think it's gorgeous or not. So I just needed a leather trench. I've been on the hunt for a leather trench for like the best part of two months. And I'd actually seen this on PLT quite some time ago. Kept on going out of stock. So I just paid attention, put my mind to it. And I was able to secure the coat. But what do we think like now once it's here. So this is the petite leather trench and this is in, I will link everything down below. Sorry, I'm not calling out their names. And this is in a size 10. I like it because it's like not too long, but long at the same time. But like, does it look good quality? Is it like nice enough to have as a leather trench? Because I'm not going to lie, I don't want to be buying another leather trench next year. A black leather trench is needed, so I want a, you know, nice ones. I've seen a couple more, a little bit more expensive ones on Misguided. And actually, the ones on Misguided were actually the same price, which led me to believe maybe they wouldn't be, um, the quality wouldn't be that much better. Then I saw one on Naked Fashion, which was like 
maybe 30, 20 pounds more. So I thought, okay, cool. If this is no good, then maybe I'll go for that one. But if you guys know any good like quality leather trenches, let me know. So this is the tall version. Um, what size is this? This is size... Um, this is size eight in the tall so i probably could have done with a size six but i like the length of this a lot better just need to like press down this collar yes no maybe so this is how it looks like when it's tied at the back which is how i would be wearing it if i just get these collars down like this i think this looks really good am i bugging i got some accessories oh my god i got this really cute fur bag and it's got this braided like handle and oh my gosh i just thought it was so cute oh my god even with this outfit so so cute i'd seen one on zara this like cream fur bag it was in my basket but i just never checked it out and every time i did want to check it out it'd be out of stock and it was dirt cheap as well with like 25 pound for some reason i just never checked it out i'm pretty sure this one is even more expensive so that bag the zara bag actually went into the sale because it went to the sale i was like yeah never getting my hands on that bag again but when i saw this one i was like oh my god this is so cute not exactly the same shape but very similar and still gives the same vibe just gonna go ahead and leave them alone because this is getting domestic yeah i'm not feeling the black as much as i'm feeling the cream I think the cream looks a lot better, but I think the black is like a necessity. I did like another accessory and it was this pair of sunglasses that I picked up from PLT and they were really cute and I wanted to show them to you guys, but I have no idea where they are. I can't find them. Loungewear. This is one of the first sets that I picked up. Everything I picked up is like a Skims dupe, Skims inspired. And I know Skims has a <laughs> in this gorgeous gray color i absolutely love this this is so nice i got both top and bottom in a size eight i believe and yeah it just fits really nicely perfect for the winter time i picked up all of the colorways that they had possible in the same thing and oh my god i absolutely love this chocolate color <gasps> this is stunning this is so nice <gasps> these are so nice guys oh my god fit the bum perfectly i got top and bottom actually in a size six those gray ones were a size eight because that was the only size left and they fit so nicely oh my god i love these um I got the black as well. I really have to get the top. What can I stretch it out? I definitely have to get the top in like a bigger size. So this is a size six and size six bottoms as well. The bottoms fit perfectly like the last one did. The top is a bit tight. So yeah, I'd go ahead and get the top in a size eight. So I'm not finna do that. But how lovely is this? You guys need to go and pick these up. These are so amazing. Oh. So so nice i absolutely love these and the trousers are not like ankle swingers this is the next item and i'm not exactly i think skims has a long sleeve dress but this is just like a long sleeve um pajama pajama loungewear dress and oh my god plt snapped with this collection because this is so stunning oh my god and it fits so nicely i got this in a size 10 because i thought a dress you don't want it to be definitely tight and oh my gosh you can even wear this out but i'm gonna keep this strictly as loungewear this is I mean, maybe I won't, maybe I won't, who knows? This is so nice, guys. I actually ordered this in the camp, this exact color. However, they sent me two of the, they've accidentally sent me two of the same thing. So they sent me two of the shirts instead of one shirt in this color and then this, or maybe it was me. I don't think it wasn't me, am I the drama? I don't think it was me. So nice. <gasps> Look how it fits. 
I'm going to get that camel color right now. I got this in a size 10 and I love that like, the little button detail. Okay guys, so I don't think this is like a Skims dupe, um, but it's a really gorgeous pajama set. So it's got the crop top and again, it's in this beautiful nude color. So it comes with these like wide leg trousers which I could go a size smaller, I could or I couldn't, like it depends, but um, they fit nicely anyway, they're just a bit baggy here in the front and they come with the matching crop top which just looks so flattering on, if I get a smaller size, yes or no, this type of thing you could even like wear out the house in summer, Skims have these like really gorgeous mini like jersey robes, They I think they have the maxi ones, and they may have the mini ones as well. And I've seen the mini ones on Aaliyah and they just look so nice and cozy and comfortable. So when I saw these on PLT, I was like, it's, do you use it more? I have to pick it up. And this is just so cute and so comfy and so cozy. Look, you can be chefing it up in the kitchen. I'm done with this on. I picked up the very same thing, but in the grey. Grey, it's even better. Gorgeous, stunning, amazing. Really like this grey colour. I think it's so cute, so prim, so proper. Lounging around the house, like, oh! All of the loungewear bits were absolute success. Not returning any of those. Do let me know what you guys think about the leather jackets and those jumpsuits. So, I'm about to find something to eat because I am a starving Marvin. All the links for that haul will be in the description box down below. Good morning, guys, and happy Thursday. Um, I woke up to... Um, a delivery of some flowers. So we're about to find out who they're from. They brought them here really early because it's actually like not even 8 a.m. So a lot. These are absolutely gorgeous, aren't they? Guys. It says roses are red, violets are blue. Lend me 40 grand and I'll marry you with Simon <laughs> Levev. How do you say his name? Levy Levev. Have you guys watched the Tinder Swindler? If you have not watched the Tinder Swindler, this will absolutely make no sense. But if you haven't, go and watch it. Peter is down. My enemies are after me. Send me 25k. <laughs> have you guys watched that yet? says inside the card my enemies are after me be my valentines or i'm sending them your address <laughs> this is so cute hi guys good afternoon yeah good afternoon happy what is today today is thursday no today is actually friday this week has gone so quickly um last time i saw you guys was yesterday and um, when I was opening it up, <laughs> my delivery, my flower delivery that I got. So today I'm actually filming my get ready with me. I was supposed to do it yesterday, but I didn't. So that is what I'm going to do today, this evening. And then I'm supposed to be going to try and get content late in the evening. Supposed to be. I don't know if that's going to happen yet, but I will try and make something happen. And then tomorrow we're going to do my nails. I'm actually going to get my brows done. So I'm not going to get microblading. I'm going to get something else. Like basically like filling in my brows to make them look like a bit more present. When I wake up, like I just want to like kind of be almost like put together already without trying too hard. So I'm getting fat removed from my chin tomorrow as well. So you know. We're getting a lot of things done, but I've got a delivery that I want to show you guys. Um, and it's from none other than Nelly Studios. 
and they were so kind enough to gift me um, a gorgeous coat from who emailed me kind enough to gift me a gorgeous coat from their autumn winter collection so I wanted to show you guys what I got battery is about to die we got the dust bag as well Let's open her my battery died mid unboxing but let's continue to open her up so oh she's stunning oh guys wow okay so i got the leather mac except i got the shilling version <gasps> guys <gasps> guys <gasps> this is so gorgeous <gasps> stunning stunning absolutely stunning what do we think guys like hit like that oh gorgeous guys what do we think a big thank you to Nelly Studio for gifting me this jacket I'm so eternally grateful guys because this this is amazing oh my god i'm so in love i will be wearing this jacket all weekend because what the frick this jacket is stunning i really wanted to get a black one because i have a nude color i've got the brown so yeah i wanted a black one I wanted a black jacket. Oh my gosh, I'm so in love with this jacket. Thank you so much, Nelly Studios. Also, I received some gifting from for me the label. Um, there's a girl that I follow on Instagram. She is simply stunning. Her outfits, guy, hmm. this babe is fashion i absolutely love all her outfits her name is for me for me toronto started a brand called for me the label and wow all her pieces are absolutely stunning so she sent me this gorgeous skirt and it just says designed with the woman in mind who is comfortable in herself and her style i'm not sure the name of this skirt but it's this beautiful like um auburn rust color skirt and um, you guys will need to see it properly on in this beautiful color and it's a leather skirt you guys know that i do love me a leather skirt it's ruched on the sides and then it's got the splits on the side of the skirt she sent me the bodysuit it's got the cut detail here and then it comes across the neck here and it's one shoulder so basically to wear with this the skirt is a little long on me but i'm gonna have to wear some like high heels because i'm a short babe so if you're a tall babe just know these will be perfect on you the skirt is so like well fitting but stretchy at the same time like i wasn't like <laughs> It fits so nicely on so easily, but it's not big on me at all. I do not have to get this taken in. Like, it fits perfectly. Stunning. Like, absolutely lovely pieces. So, a big thank you to, for me, for sending those pieces out. I will also link them down below. Um, Guys, yeah, I'm going to stop procrastinating. going to get on with this. Get ready with me because a big has deadlines and yeah let me take this instagram picture first hi guys so um i'm currently vlogging from my phone because i actually have my vlog camera but i left the sd card in my laptop because that was 
editing this morning. And I bought loads of different SD cards so I can have like SD card in my camera, SD card in my laptop, just SD cards on the go. But I seem to have, I haven't lost them, I know where they are, but this week was a bit hectic and everything was everywhere. That's what happens when I don't stay organized. But today is Saturday and I'm on my I'm on my way to get my nails done and also get my eyebrows done. And when I get there, I will like vlog on my phone and like tell you guys more about it because I'm not sure what the process is actually called. I know it's not microbaded, but I'm going to get my brows done so they look a bit more prominent and together. But um, yeah, I'm wearing my Denny Studio coat. Hopefully the quality is not too rubbish. I need a new phone. But yeah, I'll see you guys when I get them. Okay guys, so we've started the brow lamination process mm -hmm. this is what we're actually doing hopefully i'm gonna look somewhat not browless <laughs> so what we are applying now that's the glue that's the glue the eyebrows up okay so basically we're gonna try and set them in this, this position okay Okay guys, so this is the end result and how amazing. <sighs> if you want your brow lamination, abundance beauty chow. We do everything here. No guys, I actually have brows. I look like <laughs> a normal person. We use the darkest color, right? Mm -hmm. We use black. We use black. Still giving very natural. These are my brows, not yours, you know. Cute. I went for uh, like a high arch because, yeah, I need to frame my face. But yeah, I'm so happy with this. This looks amazing. Guys, so I just got here. So cold outside. We're at War Cosmetics. Let's see if you know. Come out looking like a different person, maybe. I'm shaking. But yeah, I'm gonna vlog while she's explaining what we're gonna do today, guys. So we decided we're just gonna stick with the fat dissolving. And if anything, if I wanna come back and get filler, I'll do that. So we're gonna try and get rid of the southern fat here. I'm gonna draw some grids under. Okay. Obviously, I'm gonna do it more like centered mm -hmm. to the middle of your chin, like I said, yeah. Perfect. How long does it usually take? That should be done. Yeah. Two minutes. To be honest, I filmed all my videos this week, so oh, yeah. I can be swollen for a couple of days. Don't mind it. If that was lucky for me, to be fair, you're actually looking all right right now. I don't think you're going to get swollen. Please. But just do the cold compress anyway. Like. Okay, cool. Yeah. All right, then. Anyway, yeah. Mm. Yeah. 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 
Is that it? Yeah, all done. Thank you. Wasn't that bad, didn't it? No, it wasn't at all. That wasn't painful. But I'm decent with injections. Like my pain tolerance is not bad. Yeah. Okay, so we await the results. We await. Slim chin, loading, lovely jawline coming. But I'll keep you guys updated with the results. I'll leave all of her information in the description box down below. So do not forget to check that out. Hi guys and welcome. I was gonna say welcome back, but um, happy Sunday. Today's the day before Valentine's Day. So yeah, So anyways, key hotel setting the day before Valentine's Day. I told you guys like I'm not really trying to do anything tomorrow. Just wanna chill. So yeah, we're at a hotel called The Gantry. It's in Stratford. It's really pretty, like very dark and vibey. Which is like my mood nowadays. Like I'll show you guys the bathroom. So this is the bathroom. Very pretty influencer bathroom. We've got the lights. They're all prepared. I'm wearing that misguided set that I showed you guys earlier. That's very, very cute. Already done my makeup so we can just like get ready to go. So this is just the view of the room. The windows are pretty dirty, like they need to sort that out. We've got like a city view. Hi, hello. This is very cute. We have the bed over here. It's giving very like, yeah, like I said, like dark and vibey kind of vibes. Couch, TV. and a mirror but um yeah happy the day before valentine's day going out to eat quickly i'm wearing this top from great little thing i just tied it up in one of these pants that i got last year i believe from um asos and then my tom ford heels just because i can't be bothered and cute casual outfit and then my christian dior bag which is very simple <laughs> Seriously, I don't know who she wants. Is she wants <laughs> The big T. Did you just say? Peter is down. That's not his real name. His name is Simon. His name is Simon. We brought our bags down because we we're checking out the room at 11 and it's already 10.30 anyway. But we're going to get some breakfast. This place looks a lot better during the daytime. Very cute. Fruit signs that you don't know. It's like grapes, strawberry, yeah. pineapple. Okay. Apple, green apples. Oh, green apples. Okay. Yeah. Um, can I get the classic for English, please? And how would you prefer the eggs, ma'am? Um, can I have the eggs runny, please? So you want a full English breakfast? Yes, please. So sunny side up, right? Uh, yes, please. Okay. And for you, sir? Yeah, I'm just and you gonna have this one too, the fresh fruit cuts? Um. Yeah, because there's some fruits that I can't have, so, so that's why I need to. So which fruit you don't want? You don't. Eat? Um, no melons. Melons are there. Oh, okay, then no, it's fine. <laughs> I'll just wait for the orange juice. Thank you. Okay, what's 
toast. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, it's nice. It'll be a little bit thicker. I like to taste bits. Nice ones. Oh, I didn't ask for oat milk in my hot chocolate. <gasps> Good morning guys, hi, hello. Um, I just came here to actually end off the vlog because I'm going to be starting another vlog tomorrow. Not today because I've got a lot of stuff to do today, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Um, I feel like this vlog was very, wasn't as seamless as I usually like my vlogs to be. But anyway, if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. If you like this video, please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up as it really, really does help me a whole lot. But yeah, I love you guys so much and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.